Hi guys, welcome back to another hair tutorial with me. Okay, so today I'm gonna brush these out because really bad by the way. I got them off Wish, so I mean that's probably why they shed really bad. I'll show you when I'm done brushing it. What the but I can't do that. So we're gonna brush it and then I'll give it some relief after we brush it. Also, these shed really bad. <clears throat> I need to wash my hair today. That's for sure. Um, it's very itchy. And I just want to, like, scratch my scalp. Ooh, the back of the hair is really weird to... Because I'm laying down, you know? <sighs> so what are you guys up to today? this filter with the little sparkly freckles. It's like... Wow. That is not okay. The hair already. Alright, let's do this side now. Look at this. Okay, I don't know where that stopped, sorry. But this is poofy. Sink looks like. I think it's probably from Wish because the fact that they're like, I don't know, from there or something. Could be, I don't know, maybe all. There's the wad and this is all coming from the extensions. Like it sheds, the extensions shed. And like I said, I think it's probably there. Okay. So like cleaning this out for reference. Oh. Okay, so for instance, here's the brush. Like, that's what that looks like after I brush my hair. Like, that's ridiculous. How much hair comes out? <clears throat> What's the plans for your Tuesday? Mine is go to work. I don't want to, but I have some. And have them take them out. Like, I guess, does anybody have any suggestions on that? Um, of like timeline of when I should do it. Tape ends are like this and they start to shed eventually. I don't know when is a good time to go back to my salon. Just giving her a quick refresh. hurt it burns it's because my scalp has scabs I know scabs I'll spray spray it's almost in my eye Okay. I'm sorry guys, my hair is just so bad. Okay, we're gonna... I mean, I really don't want to, because like, the length is everything. Look at that big old poof. I don't think that's, I think that's the best one I've done so far. I didn't talk as much though in the beginning, you know? Alright, so because... My hair is thick enough to where I do not have to wrap it more than once. And boom, you're good to go for the whole day. 
ponytail. And I wrap it twice like she's a little cinnamon bun. And let's get this out of there. Got her all trusty. Twist, 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 twist. And then I'm just gonna roll her around. Come back here. Got all my hair here, right? And you just come back here. And I'm going to bed. Sorry. Okay. So next step. I'm gonna just Well, now that's over with. The video's about to end. There we go. Look at that. Crazy. I know. And there. Here. Let me put this. Let me put things into perspective for y'all. 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 So there's that. Let me go into the sink. You can see it all right there. So I'm going to show you what this looks like on my bathroom sink. Are you ready? Okay, we can't even gotta get close. So yeah, like anyways, um, <clears throat> I don't know what was the last thing that I said on the last video. So... I bought these from the store. I have a feeling that I'll probably ovulate on my fertility meds. Um, day five was Saturday, so I'm no longer taking the Clomid now. Um, now I play the waiting game of when am I going to get... Um, also, if you guys want a Clomid update from my... Find out, as soon as I find out, then obviously. Only, only the best for my baby, okay? Because then that'll be all out of my system by the time I was to go to the doctors. <sighs> but this is fine. And so, I, so I will go. I will go ahead and quit when the time is right. Because I, I quit smoking, smoking, pregnant, and everything. Um. And that was cigarettes. So, uh, not as terrible, but still as terrible. Um, it's just kind of who I am. I know I did with Brent. Um, before he, I was pregnant, I quit smoking. But, you know, I didn't pick it back up while I was I stopped smoking, smoking, smoking. Not this. I'm still doing this. Once I'm pregnant, though, guys, I will give this up. Um or Thursday is when I'm going to start like kind of testing myself to see where I'm at um, um, this weekend or sometime this week like probably Wednesday um, tomorrow <sighs> but yeah so Swings where I was crying about everything. Isn't that cute? I had hot flashes all weekend and it was like. But then I came home and I had the moods. And let me tell you Clomid brings on hormones, it gives you hot flashes like a motherfucker. Like, I, we'll see if it works. I'm hopeful that it works, but if it doesn't, then I, you know, I won't be okay. I won't be too sad. But these hormones, man. So, yeah. Um, but who knows? 
But okay, I better get off here. I'm gonna go, you know, do stuff. Motherly things and whatnot. Not hot. I'll just be happy to have another baby. Because I see all y'all with your babies and they so cute and I'm like, oh, well, what? No, that's not the word I'm looking for. Keeping it surprised and apparently you'll be happier. Ain't that some shit? Ain't that some shit? I guess it's okay though. Keeping it Let me know the gender until the baby's born. So I have to wait nine months to know whether I am a boy or a girl. And sad part is, guys. <coughs> sad part is, is my husband won't. We'll see if the COVID works. Hopefully, your girl will be carrying a baby soon. Girl shit today. It's broke girl shit. Bye. Thank you.